Welcome to Ricky's IT. In this video, we are going to learn how to set up firewall connection between the devices and how to block an IP address uh, or how to block the ping service rather uh, as a mode of connection between PC0 and PC1. So in the last video, you guys have seen how to configure the IP addresses. This is just the continuation of the same. And in this video, we are going to go a little further and set up the firewall. So this is the network topology. I have given the IP address to routers, router as 20.0.0.1 to PC0 as 0.2 to PC1 as 0.3. So to set up the firewall, go to PC0, firewall section, and set up some inbound rules. Let's say we are going to deny the ping services between PC0 and PC1. So basically the protocol is icmp which is the ping service and the remote ip would be 0.0.0.0, .0. and the remote wildcard mask would be 255.255 same number same number then we press add okay so we are going to not allow the ping service between these two pieces but what if I want to um, allow PC0 to, P, uh, to access PC1's IP address, but not interact with each other through ping service? So we have not allowed the ping service, but we are going to allow the IP addresses, uh, uh, both of both the PCs to view each other, view, view each other's IP address. To do that, press allow protocol IP remote IP 0.0.0.0 .0. remote wildcard mask is 255.255 same number same number press add okay now we are going to see if I'm able to ping from PC0 to PC1 failed why because we have set up inbound role rules in the firewall section of pc0 that's why we are not able to use the icmp services but let's check if i'm able to access the ip address of pc0 from pc1's web browser and the ip address of pc0 is 20.0.0.0 Let's go. Server reset connection. Okay, so we are we are successfully able to access the IP address of either of the PCs, but just not able to ping each other. For safety reasons, we can double check. We can go to command prompt and ping PC zero. PC zero's IP address is twenty point zero point zero point one. Oh, strange it's able to communicate let's let's see again I think it's taking some time to realize but let's see I'm able to ping PC1 No, I'm not able to ping PC1 because I have set up the firewall norm on PC0 to not interact with PC1. So here we go, guys. This video was successful in showing that how we can restrict the ICMP services between PC0 and PC1, but allow them to interact with each other using the IP addresses and i will be uploading more videos about um how to do various setups in cisco packet tracer 
this is just the beginning guys uh thank you so much for watching my videos please like share and subscribe my channel thank you so much tada bye bye